Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today on this video I will show you how to fix iPhone stuck on recovery mode and support for iOS 17 without losing data. In everyday use, it is common that your iPhone stuck in recovery mode. No matter what model your iPhone is and which version of iOS it's running on, this issue happens from time to time. You may wonder why it gets stuck and interferes with your user experience. Is there a way to get out of this stuck problem? Please check this out. First of all, please plug the iPhone to computer with USB cable. Then go to Alt Phone iOS System Repair. You can repair iOS or Mako system by yourself like a pro, and also can downgrade from iOS 17 beta without iTunes. One click to enter and exit recovery mode on iPhone, iPad, or iPod and can fix 150 more I.O. system issues like Apple Logo, Reboot Loop, and Black Screen without data loss. Repair and downgrade Mako system in minutes. You can reset your iDevice without password or iTunes. And upgrade to latest Apple operating system and include the beta version. This is support for iOS versions and iDevice models. EO system repair under many scenarios such as iPhone is disabled, Apple logo, stuck in recovery mode, black screen, frozen screen, boot loop, and many more. And you can fix iDevice system issues without data loss. And you can downgrade from iOS 17 beta or upgrade to formal version without losing data. And go back to factory reset the iDevice without password one click to enter or exit recovery mode easily. And can fix 200 more iTunes errors. Easy to use, even beginner can use this tool. And you can fix the iDevice only three steps. Okay, please download and install Old Phone IO System Repair. It is available on Windows and Mac. On this tool, you can use I.O. System Repair, enter or exit recovery mode, I.O.'s upgrade or downgrade, and reset device. Here, we will try to fix a device with I.O. System Repair. Please select your preferred mode for repairing your device, and read the notes before you repair the device, and click Repair. Then download the firmware. Make sure you have good connection to download the firmware. The firmware package is ready to install and fix your device. Please click Repair and this tool will automatically fix your iDevice. Please wait until the process complete. Go back again to your device. Your iPhone is automatically restart, fixed and back to normal. Please wait until you see the home screen. And yeah, the iPhone has been successfully repaired and back to normal again. I very recommend you to use this tool, because easy to use, even beginner can use it. You can check the link on description. Okay, thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe this channel to get more video update about iDevice. See you again.